Hello everyone, Night Guy here. Gonna do a quick upload on my Honshu Boshin um, double edged um, katana, is what you'll normally find it if you look it up. Um, when I got it in the box, I did a review video on it I, where I unbox it. Go ahead and check that out. Uh, it's also advertised as a ninja sword, so that's kind of cool. Um, I haven't tried any cuts with it yet, so that's what we're gonna do tonight. This is a that a 1060 carbon steel double edged blade nice little fuller uh, it's double edged most of the way the this side here from here to here it's flat you can see the nice honshu logo on there um, I never noticed this till now also it has the carbon steel design there and this is said to be a 1060 um, it has a pretty good balance it's kind of hard to hear with the AC, but you could definitely hear it cutting through the wind at least. Um, it looks cool as heck. Really small guard, but I'm glad it's not too heavy. This sits right at two pounds, which is exactly what I was looking for. I was trying to get a thin, uh, you know, broadsword essentially. Um, and I think this will meet the requirements. I've seen mixed reviews on it. Um, I like the balance. It's still a little blade heavy. It definitely still feels like a katana in the hands versus, you know, how I prefer some broadswords to be balanced, but it's not bad. Um, I figured it would just be the little brother to the uh, Han Hanshu um, hand and a half uh, bastard sword that they have. Uh, but this does feel more like a katana, back to that. Um, so we're just going to do some cuts real fast. Uh, St. Patty's Day, happy St. Patty's Day to everyone out there. I'm going to start with a small, uh, I'm going to try to attempt a precision cut on a smaller target just to see how it swings before I hit anything hard. Okay. Smacked that one to the side, didn't okay. quite cut it. Let's try this one. Well, smacked those. So let me try another bottle. I normally have good luck with cutting through these. Not bad. Try another one. Seems like I have better luck with the bigger bottles. Let's try one of these uh, soda jugs. These tend to be pretty thick. Pretty thick plastic. Not quite. Kind of tough. I have I had a lot better luck cutting with the half broad sword that's definitely heavier but it seems like this is going to be my go-to all right impacted there you know might just be my form when i did my cuts with my uh, shinwa double-edged sword i was having trouble with that one as well but i'm not going to give up let's try another cut <laughs> Yeah, want to give it a try? Sure. We're gonna let a uh, Tiger Ninja give it a few a few uh, swings, see what he thinks. As a pure beginner, you know, I try not to speak too badly against any sword. I always, you know, take the blame. Uh, you know, if I'm having any trouble, but I am having a little struggle with it. It still feels pretty solid, but you know, we're only hitting water bottles, so who's to say? I've heard that the pommel tends to break off of those. But let's see if uh, you could get some better cuts. Definitely feels good in the hand. Yeah, yeah, the, the handle, that, that rubber grip is really comfortable. Yep. Yep, you definitely thwacked it pretty good. All right. We got a nice dent, but no cut. We're gonna try to hit that one again. All right. Looks like you, you, made, you made it explode. Yeah, there's definitely burst. Alright. Just abused it. I figured it'd be a good idea to warm up with this blade. Yeah. 
Alright, so I'm going to try one last heavier bottle. I'm going to try one more good cut. And then I'm going to do a thrust, and we'll call it a day with the video. Man. That thing cut the uh, label. It's a great label cutter. Alright, let's try it though. Not bad on the yeah, thrust. Let's, let's see what kind of draw potential cut potential we got. Not bad. <laughs> a little easier now. All right, so, you know. Definitely um, a good thruster. Definitely a good thruster. There's that. Um, I'm not really, you know, hating. Let me try a one-handed cut and a one-handed thrust. Just to see. I do, like I said, I'm a beginner, so. Not bad on that. That thrust works. Let's try a one-handed right. cut. I'm a little better with my right hand on my left. Yeah, definitely doesn't feel too comfortable one-handed. Um, what can I say? Uh, as far as cutting, I'm not a big expert on what is the best for cutting, but this, you know, it, it didn't break. There's that. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I feel like, you know, this may take a, a higher level of skill than I currently possess to really be effective with cutting with it. But it is nice. It is a great piece. I'm definitely still recommending it as a piece to buy. The thrusts are really nice. Um, it still feels like it cuts like a katana, but, you know, with a standard single-edge curved blade katana, I tend to have better luck. Um, so, that, that's that. That's the uh, Honshu uh, test cuts that we were trying out today for you. Uh, that's my feedback on it. I, I still like it. It still feels pretty solid. I don't have anything loosening or anything yet, but mind you, I was just hitting bottles. Um, I will come back and do some good torture tests with these very soon. Promise. Thanks for watching.